Getty Audio. Yo! Screen ca- Back at it again with another episode of Two White Guys. Two White Guys. We may not want the gain to be way up whenever we're breathing into the microphone. Hey guys, welcome back to Two White Guys. Make sure we're not peeking while we talk like this. I'm going to go Yo, ahead and talk. What's yeah, up? we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're not going to be hype because this is going to be just making a tear list. Two White Guys. See, that only went into the yellow. I hate you. <clears throat> okay. My guys! Okay. <laughs> Presentation mode. All right. And. Full screen? Yeah. Perfect. Welcome back to another Two White Guys. Welcome to the first ever Two White Guys tier two list. Tier list video. Two tier list guys. So we're Are gonna... we going to change any of these? I thought it said Home B, but it says Horrible. Do you want to? I think these are fine. Or do you want to they're do like fine, but they're very. S A B. They're. I get the reference. Um, like S A B C D F. I, there's just a reference. You know, I'm Dante, or uh, six seconds. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. I don't want to talk about so it. So do you wanna? I would just leave it like that. I okay. was just gonna say, um, where's League? <gasps> I'm gonna hurt you. At least. I haven't played it. Okay, here's the so, thing. Let's just put it back. Wait, wait. And let's just start. Wait. Are you just going to put a league tier list? Here's the thing. League is actually a really well-made game, and it's good. It's just the people make it bad. So are we going to judge a game based on the community around no, it? No, So... Because if we're basing it off the community, I fully agree it goes horrible really yeah, bad. Yeah, I'm, I'm just I'm, I'm just memeing. But if we want, they just came out with a new durability patch, so I'll put it in, like, really bad because I am pissed about it. But no, <laughs> it's we'll put it in, like, good or very good. There's a reason why it's one of the top games like that. Like, okay. It's one of the top games for a reason. Have you played Bioshock? Yes, Bioshock's a good game. Okay. It's a good game. It's pretty good. Have you played, I think that's Symphony of the Night? No. Okay, me neither. What about Fallout New Vegas? I played it for like five minutes. You so let's I, just put it in Half Life. Yeah. I haven't played any of the Half Lives. I haven't played them for long enough. Street Fighter Two? No. I'd put it in. It's gonna be you. Um. They're gonna see leagues at the very good mark, and then I'm gonna put it in good. Okay. So establishing rules for this. It's not the community. It's not... It's just... The, how, this is how much we enjoy the game. It's not the devs. It's just you play the base game by yourself, like Smash Ultimate right yeah. there. We're I not judging it, that by the online mode. I put it in either amazing or great. If you have friends and you want to play the game with friends or you do whatever, that's you. But this is like how... This is our experience playing the game. Yeah, I put it in amazing or great. Yeah, I'll put it up there. I've had a pretty amazing experience. Like I've been really happy playing it with my friends. Yeah, let's put. I'll put it in amazing. Uh, TF2. No. I haven't played it. I'll just say no if I haven't played it. Okay. Until dawn. No. Warframe. Mm, no. What if I know it's a bad game? <laughs> if you haven't played it, let's just put no, it. No. Haven't played no. it. Uncharted Four. I'll put it in in good. Have you played it? Oh, I've played it multiple times. Uh, more better than Bioshock. They're just different games. Like you don't want to you, you don't want to compare it. Uncharted to Street Fighter. Did you enjoy it more than Bioshock? Yeah. Okay. I'll put I'll leave Street Fighter at the bottom of good. Uh, I think Yakuza. I don't know no. which one that is. I haven't played any Yakuza. Battlefield One. I'll put it. Mm, I'll give it a decent for the people. Okay. For the people. Tony Hawk Pro Skater Two. No. Uh, Red Dead 2. Uh, great. I'll I put it in great it. or very good. Uh, I'll put it in great just because it's over league. <laughs> I haven't played it. I'll say I'll say no for Dota. I've played it okay. once, but it wasn't the best experience. Uh, three Houses? I'd put it in... Uh, what, what would, at least... What would you put it in? It's going to be at least decent, but I'm feeling at least good or higher. I was going to say very good, so let's just put it in good. I'm fine with very good. Okay. Do you like it better than League? No. Okay. League is like, I just, I love League for personal okay. reasons. I think Fire Emblem 
I think Three Houses is a very good entry point to Fire Emblem. It was my entry point to Fire Emblem. And then I went back and played some older ones. And by older ones, I mean Awakening and Fates. <laughs> and I, I really enjoyed it. I uh, finished the Yellow Deer Path. The Golden Deer Path, I mean. Uh, Halo Reach, I haven't played it, but I know it's a good game. But we already said. Halo is... Have you ever played Halo Reach? Mm, not enough. Okay, yeah. I I know it's like... You know it's... Let's oh, just put like it in up now. Up here. Just put it in now. Yeah. Sonic Mania? No. Decent. I know there's a lot of people going to get mad. I, I played a Sonic Collection. But I'm just not a big Sonic fan. I'm not either. I've not played a hat in Like, time. I know it's well made, but I just don't really like... I'll put it in good. I've not well, played a hat I'll put it at the top of decent. I mean, you played it. <laughs> How did you like it? I thought it was fine. Well, then put it in decent or bad. <laughs> Uh, Hat and Time haven't played Arkham City or Asylum. Have you played any of the Batman Arkham games? Um, yes. Which one is it? Uh, I can't tell. The text is too small. I'll put that one in like... I'll put it in Decent. Okay. Decent was my experience. Better than Battlefield? Yeah. Okay. I'll put Sonic under Batman. Just to... Jungle Party? Why is this in the best games of all time tier list? Oh, this is supposed to be best games of all time? Yes! I think the person just picked a bunch of random games. Uh, Modern Warfare 3. Good. Okay. Uh, better than Bioshock? Yeah, for me. Better than Uncharted 4? No. Okay. Uh, Crash Nitro Kart? No. I played, like, one match of it on, like, the remake on Switch because it was free for a while with Switch Online, and I didn't like it at all, but I haven't, like, played it enough to, like, actually justify giving it a score. Mass Effect 2. Mass Effect as a series goes right next to Bioshock because they're, like, the exact same thing to me. Specifically 2, though? I just... Above or below Bioshock? They're the same to me. Like they're, I think Bioshock. I put it below Bioshock. Yeah, I'll put it because it's like, you're set in your head. It's like, which not as memorable. Yeah, Bioshock is more memorable, definitely. All Whenever right. I think of Mass Effect, I think of Bioshock. But when I think about Bioshock, I don't think about Mass Effect. Okay. Which uh, one is that? Final Fantasy Seven. I think it's good. Ooh, which one's Seven? The one with Cloud, and Sephiroth, and all that. Is there only one with Cloud and Sephiroth? Uh, that's the original of Cloud and Sephiroth. People... Like for PlayStation. I don't know if people are going to hate me for this. My favorite, and actually, like, the only... One of the only Final Fantasy games I've played and enjoyed is the one that has... I don't remember which game it is. There's a black guy with an afro, and he has, like, a yellow chick, like a bird, flying in his afro, and that's, like, my favorite character in any game ever. And I love that dude, and I, he is precious, and that makes it my favorite Final Fantasy game. I don't know which one that is. I don't either. I'd say 7 is, from what I've played of it, I, I, I haven't played very much of it, but what I've played of it, it was good. It's Look at, look at it. <laughs> He's cool. I love it, and the, it like lives in his hair. <laughs> That's he has cute. like a fro, it lives in there. Which, I don't know which game it is. It's Saz Kaz... Catch Roy? I don't know. Just click on the wiki page. But I think he's in multiple. Basically, the game starts, and this guy's in the game, and then you have to, like, walk and fight this huge monster on, like, some kind of train or something. It's so little. Oh. I love this guy. Uh, eight. Or 13. Final Fantasy 13. And 13, too. All right. I'll put, have you played seven? I don't think so. I've watched Michael play it, okay. and it looked really good for the remastered one on the PlayStation. I'll put it... This is the original, though. <clears throat> oh, uh, I'll put it in good or decent. I'll pu I was going to put it in good. Since you put it in decent, I'll put it over okay. Street Fighter. What's this? Uh, this Watch is Dogs? Watch Dogs. Watch Dogs is a good game, but I haven't played it. I've watched people play it. I haven't it, played so it either. I'll put it now. Uncharted 3? Yes. I'll... Mmm... Uh, I think Uncharted 4 
it's I think Uncharted 2 was my favorite. Well, hopefully it's on here. But I think 4 was a better game than 3, but I enjoyed 3 more. So do you want to put them like close to each other? Yeah, my experience for 3 was that it was better than 4 because I played it with my dad. So like right here, maybe? Yeah, sure. Okay. I really liked it. I like that some of them are circles. Yeah, <laughs> Metal Gear Rising. No. Bloodborne. Not enough. I don't know what that is. Oh, uh, Metal Gear Solid 4. Never played Metal Gear. Lego Star Wars 2. Never played it. You uh, played it? <laughs> uh, my first ever video game ever was Lego Star Wars 2 on the DS. Okay. Uh, n not biased, though. I'll put it in good. Uh, but it's supposed to be biased. We're saying our experience with the game. Well, like... I don't re actually remember if it's actually a good game or not. So, like, our experience of thinking it's a good game, I guess. Yeah, I'll put it... I'll put it right here. I have not played Uncharted 3 since Uncharted 4 came out. Mm. Shadow of the Colossus. Nope. I want to, but no. XCOM 2. I'll give it a decent. Okay. I'll put it at the end. Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. Nah. Grand Theft Auto, I think that's four. Yeah, Grand Theft Auto four. Uh, I've played San Andreas a little bit. I'm not a Grand Theft Auto fan. Metal Gear Solid two. Assassin's no. Creed is that Black Flag? I haven't played any Assassin's Creed. Okay. I'll put Smite in a decent. Above XCOM. No. It's like Smite is going to be the lowest of the low because I, <laughs> I want to put it in bad. Smite is the barrier of entry for decent. You yeah. want to put it in bad? Well, it's 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 like the like barrier of decent and bad. Top of bad or bottom of I decent? I don't think Smite is a bad game, but my experience with it was really bad. Okay. So uh, I'll just – you could put it in bad. Just for the just sake of having something in bad. Yeah. Doom 2016? No. Okay. Borderlands 2. I'll put it in very good. It was my uh, favorite Borderlands Above game. Above Fire Emblem? <clears throat> yeah. Above League? No. Is Okay. Final Fantasy, I think that's 16. Or 15. 13? No. 15. It's XV. Oh, it's 15. I don't know. Okay. What is that? Watch Dogs 2? Uh, I don't know. Why are both Watch Dogs games on here? I guess they're goaded. Dark Souls 3? I've only played one. Dark Souls 1? Bad. Really? I played the game for about 10 hours, 15 hours, and it was a terrible experience. Hmm. And here's Was the thing. it worse than Smite? Move Smite to really bad and put this in bad. <laughs> okay. Move Smite to really bad. Okay, so... <clears throat> listen, Dark Souls is... I played it when I was like a kid, and I was confused, I didn't understand, I didn't like it that much. Uh -huh. And then I went, when I was older in high school, I was like, I'll play it again, maybe I'll enjoy it. And then I played it for like four or five hours, and I was like, I don't understand the appeal of this game, it's not fun. Dark Souls is not fun. And then I played it for Xbox, Okay. I think, I don't know. And then I played it again in college, and I was like, this game just sucks. And it was like a cumulative of five or ten hours, hmm. like for each session. It was like a total of like, yeah. whatever. So I played it for around five hours for each time I played it at least. And I like I was like I came into it like Dark Souls is a great game. Everyone loves Dark Souls. It's gonna be fun. And then it just wasn't. I couldn't find any enjoyment in it. Everything was too dark for me to see, mm -hmm. and the mechanics didn't make sense to me. Like uh, they had portals or weird things that just warped two places. And I was like, where does this come from? Why is this a thing? Right. I think that's Shadow of War. No. <clears throat> Need for Speed. No. But we're going to have an argument here. Mario Odyssey. I was going to put it in... Good or very good for me? I'll settle on middle of good. We can put decent too if you're really strong, but it'd be like top of decent. I think it's way better than a... Like... Personally, I would put very good because I love Mario Odyssey way more than the other games. But I, this is cumulative for both of us. I just think it's okay. 
So you think it's decent, and I think it's very good. So, so we'll just put I'll it. I'll settle on middle of good. Okay. Like there's four games in front of it and four games behind It'll it. It'll definitely get pushed around, but yeah, that's fine. I, I just think mechanically it's great, but like and presentation wise it's great, but I think like something about it just doesn't really grab me. Yeah, but that's your experience. I just think there's nothing wrong with I that. I also think it was a bit too like short, especially for like a sixty dollar experience. Probably just because I'm not like a big like collectathon kind of guy. Like I don't want to 100 percent complete a game. I understand because the speed runs are around an hour long. They're and like right under an hour. I so if you play the game casually, you could beat it in a day. If a game not specifically designed for speed running is like, oh, you need to speed run it and then you'll enjoy it i think that's that that's a bad game well i'm not saying you have to speed run it to enjoy it i'm already 64 i'm just yeah i'm just saying that if the speed runs are underneath an hour the casual time can't be that long yeah like because it's glitchless there's not like glitches you just play the game through i remember uh the saturday after i got i pre-ordered mario odyssey i got it on that friday and then i got really sick on that saturday so I did nothing but play it, and I beat it that w- that Saturday. Yeah, it's like an eight-hour game, in my opinion. Yeah. Eight, nine-hour game. I speedrun it, so I'm biased, but I, I think it's like probably an eight- or nine-hour experience. And so like I never really played it that much outside of that weekend, and I feel like I should have. It doesn't, it doesn't really feel replayable. I did like Balloon World. That was a good update. I just – it feels really replayable to me because there are so many moons. Mm-hmm. That it's like, it's like every that, time I replay the game, I can get an entirely different set of moons. If that appeals to you. Yeah. Okay. I um, think it's just our opinions. Devil May Cry 5? No. Soul Calibur 6? No. Assassin's Creed Odyssey? No. Mortal Kombat 11? Ooh, I played that. At an arcade. How do you like it? Specifically 11? I think. Does it have the two? That's the most recent one. Yeah, that's the two. I won't rate it. I won't rate it. Okay. Uh, Modern Warfare? Call of Duty? I'm playing Call of Duty. Let's move Modern Warfare 3 until after Mario Odyssey. Okay. And then we'll put... Modern Warfare and, like, Decent. Top of Decent, or? Probably. Better than (coughs) Batman? Yeah. Okay. Doom Original? No. I think it's... I haven't played. Good. Better than Street Fighter 2. Okay. Half-Life 2? Uh, no. Overwatch? Decent. I give it Decent. It was was an alright experience. It was Uh, worse than XCOM for me. I, I don't want to say anything about Overwatch because the only time I played it was on the Switch version and the Switch version is bad and I don't want that to like influence my opinion on the game as a whole. I think it's just because games like that where the entire point is being able to move your mouse around really quick and spin around and do yeah. stuff, I think it makes it really hard for the Switch. I'd put it like around Battlefield. Okay, better Before or after, I, I don't care. Whatever should, one looks cuter on the placement. Put it, let's put it after just because it's funny. Overwatch bad. You may laugh now. <laughs> we have Crash. Crash Insane Trilogy specifically. Uh, uh, I'm going to say no. I've only played the one for the GBA. I'm going to say good. Um, Isn't this the game that's like the lowest on your Nintendo Switch for least played? Yeah. That's just because every time I get a new SD card, it's the only game that doesn't require any updates or like re-downloading, so it always ends up at the bottom. So I forget about it. But uh, I think it's very well made, especially because, like, a lot of it they had to, like, remake from scratch. Like, they couldn't use the original code. So it's a very, like, impressive feat. But I'm just not, like, the hugest Crash fan. So, like, objectively, I'm going to put it... This tier list is very objectified. I think it's a decent mix of, like, opinion and just, like... But respect for but the game. out of everything, why Pokemon Emerald for the Game Boy? Oh yeah, whoever made this list is weird. <laughs> I don't mean us. I just mean the 
person who made the list. Yeah. I mean, this is a very objectified, like, who made this list was objectified in putting these on there. Yeah, like putting That's both I mean. Watch Dogs games. <laughs> like, they enjoyed Watch Dogs. All right, God of War 2. And they did not play Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2, which is the best one. Have you ever played God of War? Yeah. Which one? 2. Yeah. How'd you like it? Very good. Better than Fire Emblem? I'll put it after. Dragon Ball Fighter Z. I think this is a good game. Okay. I think I'm not going to put it higher than good just we can, because... We could put it in good. I want to put it... Is it a better fighter than Street Fighter? Yes. <laughs> And Street Fighter 2 specifically, yes. I'll put it af- after the Uncharted's. Okay. Because it's very pretty. It's a very gorgeous game. But also Uncharted is. I'm just it not... Competes. Have you ever seen, like, uh, yeah, I've seen Fighter it. Z in action? Like, it, it looks like... I didn't realize it was 3D at first. Uh, it's just that well, like, technically executed. Even on the Switch, it looks great. And uh, I'm just not good at traditional fighting games. Yeah. So I can't appreciate it to like the highest extent. So I don't want to put it further than good. Just by my own limitations. Is Smash Ultimate going to be the best game we've ever played? I hope not. <laughs> Far Cry 3. But it's neither one of our favorite games. Yeah. Uh, I have it, but I haven't played it. Okay. Uh, FIFA 20. Which one? 20. Put it in really bad. Uh, I've played some of the FIFAs. Tetris? I think this is just Tetris as a whole. Well, I know where you want to put it. I want to put it as Masterpiece. I think Tetris is, like, decent or bad. Decent or bad? I don't like Tetris. Okay, so... Uh, uh, we could just put it in uh, good. Uh, okay, very I put good. it... I'll put it... You have more Tetris than me, and you love Tetris. I'll let you pick it, but just know I think it's decent or bad, and then you do what you want from I'll there. I'll put it at the top of good. Okay. Lawful good. <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll settle for top of good. Or bottom of very good. Is that okay? Yeah. Okay. Um, <clears throat> Fortnite. You know how I feel about Fortnite. You want my, like, straight-up honest opinion from my experience of every time I've ever played Fortnite yes. collectively? Yeah. Where have we not put a game yet? In Masterpiece or Horrible. I so, thought Fortnite was horrible. Oh, I really? actually... I hated playing Fortnite. Like, I actually See, played it with my cousin, Zoe. She's, like, recently? a child. But this was, um... This was a while ago. This was, like, a year or two ago. But I also played it more recently. See, on like, the channel, mm-hmm. and like I just I, I don't think it's fun. I think it's boring and it's lame. Whenever you say you play it like it's the, the world's whatever stealth game, yeah. But I think that makes it terrible and boring. And it's like, why am I gonna sign up to play a shooter, I and then all I do is stealth? Like I, it's not it's not fun. I think, it's not objectively my. Yeah, opinion. I think it's very fun exploring the world you, you can, and the fact that the world is ever changing and like actively becoming different you could put it high up there if you want to i'm just gonna let you know my opinion right 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 because this is our list yeah and i'm fine if you wanted to put it in great amazing or masterpiece i just don't feel that way i think we can't we can't put it there if i think it's horrible yeah because good is in the middle right good is like the very middle yeah <clears throat> Because I don't, here, here's the thing, I don't hate Fortnite. I don't think, oh, Fortnite equals bad. Right. It's just playing Fortnite was just, I don't, like, you were talking about one of the games whenever that I you first, didn't like it because there was no, like, extra or, like, not bonus yeah. content, but there was no goal or something. Mm-hmm. That's how I felt when I played Fortnite. It didn't okay. feel like I wanted to be the Battle Royale champion. It felt like I was just, it, even being in combat doesn't feel or look cool. It's just two characters jumping up and down next to each other, and eventually one of them, like, disappears. Yeah. It, it's not a cool-looking combat scene. I... Compare that to, like, an actual FPS where, like, you're zooming in and scoping and trying to move around. That is partially why I like Fortnite, just because it's not like a typical shooter. It's very goofy. But I respect it for that. Yeah. But it's not an FPS. It's a... It's a, it's a third-person shooter. It's a third-person. Yeah. So I have to understand it's a third-person... But even Roblox doesn't look as bad as Fortnite to me whenever it comes to them shooting back and forth. 
Because Roblox is blocky and has bad graphics, but like, the for why is it that I'm watching someone play Fortnite? This is I know currently there's a non-building Fortnite, but my experience okay. was when we had I, building. I do agree that I don't like watching people play Fortnite because usually they, you're like okay cool. They've been running around mining a. It's like mine like they run around and mine trees and stuff for ten minutes. Five, ten minutes, mm-hmm. and then they finally find an encounter, and they immediately either turn and run, freak out and scream because they got a single piece of action in the game, <laughs> or they, um... Or they build the Eiffel Tower Or they seconds. build the Eiffel Tower, and then it's like, why are we in the sky now? Yeah, okay. Now, I, I think the non-building version is... I don't worse. mind. Really? Just because I think what made Fortnite Fortnite is the fact that you can build... That's I think true. Fortnite would have no clout and no like playability compared to what it actually has if you couldn't build in the original Fortnite because it wouldn't yeah. be anything special or different than a regular thing. And I think this is specifically saying Battle Royale, not Save the World. Yes. So I I but, like that yeah. building is still there, but there's the option to play without it if you don't want it. You know when an anime goes on for way too long, or like a TV show, Mm -hmm. and they just kind of start making stuff up, and it's like just random things thrown and pieced together? Mm -hmm. That's what I feel like Fortnite has come to now. It used to be you just drop, and then you shoot people, like PUBG type of thing. Yeah. And now it's like, you you go down, there's going to be bots on the ground, there are going to be quests NPCs you can talk to. It's like, dude, I'm I'm supposed to be in a battle royale, killing everyone for survival, and I'm going to talk to an NPC about a quest. And, and that's what ruins it for me. But that's what makes it for you. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. It's we're just, like on complete opposite ends of the spectrum because like I... The point The for fact me, that it has those kind of like extra elements to it that make it more than like just a typical battle royale in my opinion. Like those kind of RPG systems. Like I know a lot of the Fortnite community didn't really like uh, in I think Chapter 2 Season 5 where they had like the crafting system and you could like craft like primal weapons or regular weapons and like make different kind of bows and stuff i was eating that stuff up i loved the crafting system i think they underutilized it makes sense it. that there would be one i think they underutilized it i think they should have gone further with the idea but and not scrapped it after two seasons but i think it was really fun i i like those kind of rpg-ish mechanics in fortnite i think it works really well for what they're trying to do and i know a lot of people We'll say that, like, who are, like, kind of Fortnite old heads. Shout out my younger brother. <laughs> he only likes the old one. Yeah, like, he, he thinks, like, especially, like, I'll talk to him about, like, Fortnite story and stuff. But, like, what some people got to understand is that Fortnite has been building the story up in the background. And it's now coming into the foreground. Like, those seeds have been sown all the way back in, like, chapter one. Like, a while ago. Yeah. We are recording, right? Yeah, back in, like, quote-unquote, old Fortnite. Yeah. So it's always been building up to what it is today. It just isn't what it used to be, which is why people think that. I'll it's, what, do you, what do you want to gain from Fortnite? What do you want to get from a game like that? What uh, do you want in that game? I want, uh, I like... What do you enjoy in that kind of, like, a shooter? What ask, like, not a Fortnite specifically, but let's say I pulled up another third-person shooter. What would you enjoy about those games? What do you look for to think if it's a good or bad third-person shooter? Uh, I like character customization. I like, uh, weapons that feel good to use. Um, I like having... Uh, cool maps to run around and I like unique game mechanics which is also like why I like Splatoon partially so I think we're just like I'm when totally I on opposite ends of the spectrum yeah when I look at a, a game like Fortnite or Splatoon I like the presentation of it more so than the gameplay itself but I still think the gameplay is fun I play games like that for the rush mm-hmm. for the intensity of it do you like Splatoon? No. I don't think Splatoon's a bad game by any means. It's just not your kind of game? 
I also have a bias against it because I really wanted to play Splatoon and try it, and I was excited, but then I needed internet to play. Mm. We could play Splatoon for Y guys. So it was... I have two, and I have three on pre-order. It, it's one of those things where when you looked at a review of Splatoon, it was like, yeah, the story is like whatever, and it's not really good. The main mm. focus is the multiplayer action and the multiplayer... Right. And I couldn't do that. Gotcha. So I, I was very, like, put off, because that was for the Wii U, I yeah. think. And I... I I didn't have the capability to just bring my Wii U around. I didn't even have a car. I couldn't drive. I'm pretty sure if it's as old as I remember it being. So I think we just look for different things in those type of games, and right. that's what makes it and ruins it. Because you aren't looking to have your heart racing. Is this person going to be around this corner? You're looking for, oh, I get to walk around with my cute skin. Yeah, I think it's funny that... But Darth, I don't really care about skin. I think it's funny that Darth Vader can do Gangnam Style with an Among Us. And that just annoys me. Like, I don't think it's funny. I, like, I watch it, and I'm like, this just, it's just like, what I it find, is. Like, it just... I find that kind of, like, goofiness and silliness to be intrinsically satisfying. And that's funny, because I find it intrinsically unsatisfying like, and annoying. Yeah. Because I'm like, I so, just want to get in a match and play, not stare at someone Fortnite dancing for an hour. So in games like that, you look for the more extrinsic qualities to it kind of what do you mean by that like i look for more like the fun that i can make with the game and you look for more like the fun that you can have in the game like the fun that the game gives you instead of the fun that you make with the game well also you're comparing your fortnite experience to splatoon i'm comparing my fortnite experience to like more fps type of games okay and I don't play a lot of third-person shooters. Right, and I, I, I don't play a lot of first-person games. I don't, I don't like third-person shooters that much. Okay. But then I played Fortnite, and I was like, it doesn't even look good. It doesn't feel good. Like, how is it that you're a third person, and you're aiming way out there, but then, like, the way you aim is, like, fully off from the perspective, in my opinion. At least when I played it. I felt like the reticle is not where it should be. Mm. Um, however I have played a lot of third person shooters and I have found ones I like but I think we both just agree to disagree like I don't think Fortnite's a bad game at all okay so I think we I put think... Fortnite in the middle of good Okay. but do we put it above or below Mario Odyssey you know I want it below but you want it above I want it above Let's, let's rock, just put paper, it above. scissors. Let's just put okay, it above. okay. I was going to rock, paper, scissors, I, but you said above. Like I said, no, I'm, willing, back. He's World of Warcraft. I'm willing to put Fortnite in very good or like higher. I just don't feel that way. Okay. Anyway. World of Warcraft. Sorry about that 20 minute excerpt <laughs> about our emotional opinions on third person shooters. No. My experience with World of Warcraft is some dude trying to coax me into how it's not a lot of money to pay this much a month for to play World of Warcraft and it's really cheap. And we had the same job. And he was like, you you work this job like me anyway, so I know how much money you make. We make the same amount of money, and I can pay for it just fine. And I said, well, I have $5 of spending money every month, and I don't want to spend that saving up for World of Warcraft. <laughs> Pokemon Emerald. The original is what we're going to go with. Yeah, we're whatever game it Decent. says. Okay. That's my experience. I don't know if you've ever played it for the I've, Game Boy. I've played... Part of Ruby. <laughs> I'm just no, it's just. Oh, sorry. I just put it there. Uh, better than Overwatch. Yeah. Better than Battlefield One. Uh, sure. I'll leave it that. Leave better. It there. Yeah. Well, uh, I'll say it's better than Sonic Mania, okay. just because I don't like Sonic. <laughs> I haven't played it as much as a bunch of people have played it, but I've played it like enough. Yeah, I know a lot of people are obsessed with Emerald. Yeah, I don't think like Emerald's a bad game. A little bit over our age range. I mean, if someone were to put this in very good, I would say it's justified. Or yeah. like great or amazing. Like I would justify someone putting in that and I would be fine with it. Masterpiece, I'm not so sure about, but right. anyone is. God of War, PS4. Ooh. I've heard it's a very good game. Beautiful. It's a beautiful game. Uh, wait. Does this have the newest God of War on it? This is the newest God of War. That is? Yeah, the one with his son. Yeah, and you were with uh, Boy. 
Yeah. That's, his name is Boy. His name is Atreus, I think. Yeah, I know, but it's Boy. It's, <laughs> it's this, this is the Boy game. You know what? I haven't played it. But I've heard it's very good. I want to put it in great or amazing. Okay. Is, do you like it more than Red Dead 2? It's comparable to Red Dead. It's it's hard because they're entirely different games. And like Smash versus God of War. Did you enjoy it better than Red Dead 2? No. That's why I'm leaving it down there at the bottom. Okay. But also it's... I enjoyed my dad playing it more than I enjoyed playing it. Mm-hmm. It was funny to watch him. But GTA I played it. 5. San Andreas? No, not San Andreas 5. Which one's 5? The most recent one that keeps getting ported to new stuff. I don't know. Okay. I'll just say I don't know. Horizon Zero Dawn. Mm, no. No. Yakuza Zero, whatever that is. What is that? I think that's... I want to say Injustice 2. It looks like Superman, kind of. Right-click it. Inspect the properties. Or view page source. If you inspect it, you can just read the HTML. (laughs) Now we gotta find it. Well, this isn't where I was expecting. We'll just not do it. Is your IP address gonna be on here? I don't think it matters. I'm on the school Wi-Fi. How do we get out? You hit the X at the top. Alright, and just you have to get rid of this. It's it's in a different tab. Oh. <laughs> Full screen. Immersion broken. <laughs> I don't know. Just say I don't know. Lego Indiana Jones. I enjoyed it. I'll say it's a decent or good game for me. I'd say not as good as this one. So we'll put it in good. Okay. I'll put it over I'll put under it. under Doom but over Street Fighter Okay. Too. Lego Star Wars original. I played it when I was really little, but I don't remember it. I never played it. Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. We're just going to say without the DLC because we haven't played it with yeah. it. I think it's a probably... I'll put it in good or very good. I was going to say very good. Uh, yeah, good or very good. I'm fine with both. Hey, Rebecca. Hey. We're making a tier list. Uh, do you want to put it over Tetris? I like it more. I'll put it... Actually, I'll put it next to Fire Emblem. Okay. I'm yeah, I'll that. put it there. Um, Mario Galaxy. Uh, this is one, right? Yeah. And I'm just going to say this is for the Wii because I like that one more than the Switch version. Okay. That's what I was assuming, too. I beat it as a kid. I really liked it. I I'll say, say it's very good or great. I'll say it's... At least top half of good going on to great. Right. Anywhere uh, from top half of good to somewhere in great. So maybe... Very good or great. Did you like it more than 8 Deluxe? Yeah. Fire Emblem? Mm, no. Okay. I'm fine with that. Uh, Minecraft. Horrible. <laughs> the first horrible. Uh, I'd say very good. I'll put very good for Minecraft. I've had an amazing time playing it in my childhood experience, but that's fully nostalgia bias. And where in very good? I'll put it like Tetris or Galaxy. So it's it's a jump, like but I would put it around those two. Right here. Sure. Like in the middle of them. Sure. Okay. Actually, We're like halfway through. I like Minecraft more than Mario Kart. Okay, I'll agree with that. Monster Hunter World. No. Overcooked 2. No. Uh, I don't know what that is. Counter-Strike. Counter-Strike. I, I think that's original. I have not played the original Counter-Strike. Okay. Pac-Man. Pac-Man. I'll put it... I think it's overrated, but it's still good. I was going to put I, it I was going to put it in good. Or, uh, I'll say better than... I like it more than Doom. I like it yeah. more than Crash. I like it more than that. Do you like it more than Mass Effect? No, I'll... Okay. Say Pac-Man is better than Mass Effect. Persona 5, have you ever played it? Yeah. Well, yeah, you have. I've played it multiple times. How do you like it? My experience, personally, is very good. I'll just agree with whatever you say. It was very good. I'm weird. I'll very put good. it above the first God of War. Okay. I enjoyed it more than the first God of War. That's God of War 2. 3? 
Yeah. Or that's what I meant. I meant like. Oh, I, oh okay. Yeah. We tiered one God of War. Like that was the first one. In Pokemon the Sword and Shield. Uh, we have our first masterpiece. I'm ashamed <laughs> to admit it, but my experience <laughs> playing the game is gonna be in good. I was gonna say good. Yeah. Because it's an enjoyable experience. I had a good experience playing it. If someone goes, how's Sword and Shield? I'd be like, it's decent. Let's it's put it game. over Pac-Man. I'd be embarrassed to say it's a good game, but I'd be proud to say it's a decent experience. I think this is a good spot. Yeah. Is Mass Effect the <laughs> quota for a good Pong. game? Pong. I'll just put... I don't have any emotions for Pong. You can't Pong, really rate Pong. But I've played it. Put it just in the middle of decent and then like next to Sonic and Emerald. I'll put song I'll put Pong over Sonic Mania just because that's we, really funny. We built we both feel very middle. I haven't Pong. played Portal 2. Uh amazing. Amazing experience for me. Better than Smash? I'll I'll leave it under Smash just because I haven't played it. Yeah. Okay. If one of us hasn't played it, does it knock the game down a tier? I think a little bit. By, like, the smallest degree. Like, it doesn't knock it down a whole tier. It just maybe goes a little bit further down okay, the tier. Because yeah, these are cool. ranked. Okay, so League is at the top for a good reason, then. Because it should be a masterpiece. <laughs> Portal Original. I have played Portal Original, and I think it's uh, say top it's, of very good. I'll put it in very good. Do you I, like don't, I don't feel like it's top of very good. I feel like it's bottom. I feel like it's top of good. Okay, so I'll put it... I like Portal better than Mario, Mario Kart. Kart. Yeah, me too. Okay. Uh, what is Jack's bo- Jackbox Party Pack Six? Haven't played it. I've played one Jackbox, and it was the one we talked about. Yeah. Uh, Drawful. Resident Evil Two remake. Yeah. Not the remake. Resident Evil. I think that's four. No. Sekiro. I don't know what that is. Shadows Die Twice. It's like a Soulsborne type game. Mm. I haven't played it. I think Super Metroid. Have you ever played it? No. Okay, not I have. Super Metroid. I'll, I'll play the original, not Super. Is that the one on the DS? No, that's for the Super Nintendo. Okay. Because the one on the 3DS I've played and the original I've played and uh, the one for, on the Wii uh, I've played. You've played Samus Returns? That's on 3DS? I don't know which one it is, but I know you can like... The 2D side-scroller on 3DS? No. Or not 2D. The first person one? You played Federation Force? It's third person. Like like the 2D. It's a 3D game, but it's like a 2D side-scrolling perspective. It, it's like Fortnite. It's like a third person like that. Like you're looking at Samus. I'm pretty M- sure. Metroid Other M? That's on the Wii. No, it was on the DS because I would play with my cousins. And we'd bring our DSs together. What? I gotta find it. Okay, uh, but I think S- Super Metroid, on like on a technical level, like just from like. You know, it might have been Hunters. Oh yeah, Prime Hunters. Prime Hunters. I yeah. think that I think that might have been it. I think Super Metroid is a fantastic experience. I put it in greater amazing. Yeah, I don't think it was a very. But, good I think, it's also, like. A little to its detriment. Yeah, that was it. It was Hunters. Okay. To its detriment, I guess it is Super actually, Metroid yeah. is a very, like, it can be very obtuse sometimes, like, hard to figure out where to mm-hmm. go. It's just a Metroidvania. It can be a little too difficult for its own good. So instead of putting it amazing or great, I put it at, like, uh, I like it better than Mario Kart. I like it better than Portal. I like it better than Minecraft. Yeah. How do you how do you feel? I don't hate it. Okay. I could bump it down a little if you want. I don't have experience. I don't know. Okay. I don't so fight it. I'll bump it under Minecraft just because you haven't played it or under Portal. Yeah. Portal's fine. I'm Portal. Portal good. Okay. No, actually, Portal is very good. <laughs> Super Mario Bros. Two Game of the Year every year. For real. Game of the Year every year. Have you ever seen that? No, okay. but I'll I'm, say it's... I'm making a reference. I'll say it's good or decent. That's my experience. It's yeah, good I'll, or decent. I'll put it... I feel like it's a decent game. I'll put it under Street Fighter 2. Okay. 
I'll put it top of decent. Yeah. This will be the barrier. <laughs> Galaxy 2. I, I liked it more than Galaxy 1 in I its own way, but I also liked it in a, I disliked it in other ways. I, I like the structure of one more. I didn't like it as much as Galaxy 1. I'll, we could put it under it. Let's put it in, like, decent or good. I would put it in good. Okay. Good so, fun. Uh, Bottom, middle of good. Liked it more it, than... Galaxy 2 is still a good game, but it's we're comparing it that we liked it less than 1. I'll put it... I, w- I would personally put it between Final Fantasy okay. and Crash. <clears throat> I'm good with that. Are you fine with it being towards the bottom of good? Yeah. I just I was like we could put it last of good and then you're oh, like, yeah. we're move it up. I'll put it Actually I said you could put it in decent, but Yeah, I'll put it under Doom. Terraria. My experience is I feel like amazing or great. I literally I've played it almost since it launched like almost since launch day i've played terraria and i'm still playing it. i'm literally making a terraria video right now and I i've been playing it since like 2014 2015 i think it's okay i'd be willing to settle for top of good or bottom of very good i'll put it under tetris okay if that's me i like terraria is actually one of my like top like, games top games yeah I did not like <laughs> top games in this list, but just yeah, it, just of top games. Like it is a game of all time. Look, I'm letting you put Terraria in very good, and I got to uh, if I had to put Fortnite in good. I told you you can put Fortnite higher, and I'd be <laughs> fine with it. No, I'm I'm trying to be fair, you know, like I'm trying to be like, like legitimately like compromising on stuff. You yeah, because you said it was decent, and I said it was amazing or great, so you put it in bottom of very good, top of good. Yeah. What was the other one that like we had opinions on? I think it was Mario Odyssey. Yeah, we yeah. talked for ten minutes about that game. <laughs> Skyrim, Elder Scrolls. Yeah, Skyrim specifically. I think it's good. I'll put it. I have a very good experience, but I'll I'll put it like top of good. Okay, I'm fine with that. Because Oblivion, do I you didn't like, like Oblivion? Do you like Skyrim better than Terraria? No. Okay. That's not even close. Last of Us? Mm-mm. Breath, Breath of the, the Wild. Wild. I really like Breath of the Wild. We can put it high. That's the I'll only Zelda game good. I've ever bothered finishing. Very, or great, even? I'll put it top of very good, if okay. you wanted to put it in very good. I'll put it in very good or great. Okay, like, I, I'd be perfectly, I have no objections to either one of those. Okay. I'll put it top of very good, just because you, yeah. Uh, Wind Waker? Uh, I've never played it. Uh... People love it. I just, I, decent or bad. Just to make the people angry. I didn't like <laughs> we'll the game put it in the top all. of that. So, uh, Which one is this? This is Ocarina. <sighs> uh, put it, put it in decent. I was going to put it in decent. Put it in decent. I'll put it, do you like it better than XCOM? No. I'll put it. Do that's you like it? Ri- do that's, you like that's it better disrespectful than, to XCOM. Do you like it better than Wind Waker? I personally find it less interesting. So do you want to bump Wind Waker to the top, bottom of the uh, Put it in bad. Just put it. It's Zelda. It's bad. Okay. Just put it. <laughs> Based. Uncharted 2. Yeah. I like that game. I, I liked it more than some of the other ones. I'll put it in like. Just put it next to the other ones. Just okay. Make do you it, like it more than the other ones? Put, put Uncharted two, three, and four <laughs> in that order. Yeah. I think I think, four, I think four was a better game, but I liked three more when I played it, and two was my favorite. I think. I said, well, I'll, let's two, four, three. Yeah, I think four was the better game, but I enjoyed three more. So that's. Oh, then I guess yeah, two, three, four. Depending on how we're doing this tier list. It is funny that they're in order. <laughs> and then it starts with Elder Scrolls. What is Walking Dead Telltale? No. Uh, Witcher 3. Ooh, very good game. Very good. Okay. Great game, even. I'll put it next to Red Dead. Ooh, better than God of War? It looks worse than God of War, because God of War is beautiful, but I enjoyed Witcher more than God of War. Okay. Yakuza 4. Oh, Masterpiece. <laughs> uh, hey. Yakuza Apex. <gasps> Limbo! Sorry. We're not there yet. Apex. Eh. Straight up, like, actually, for real, for real. For real, for real? Decent. Okay. It's, it's, it's better than Sonic. Better than Pong? 
No. <laughs> I have zero opinions on it. So Celeste... let's put a Pong tier list because we just don't care. <laughs> a tier list of different Pongs. Celeste, I like this game a lot. Dang it. Do you not like Celeste? You know I don't. Okay. I'll, 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 I was going to give Celeste a decent. I was going to put it in, like, towards the middle or bottom of very good. So let's I was going to say... give it a decent. A lot of people would just throw Celeste as a masterpiece and not question it. I'll put Celeste under Fortnite over Mario. That's fine. You love Fortnite, and I, I think it's justifiable Fortnite goes to the top. Because I don't hate Fortnite. My gaming experience playing it was bad. Right. And, I, like, I don't hate Mario Odyssey. I just didn't have a, as much fun as other people do. Yeah. Like, I don't think Fortnite's bad by any means. I think Fortnite is a really, like, I think Fortnite is a great or amazing game, but, like, my experience playing it. Right. Okay. This tier list just completely changed. Chrono Trigger? No. Dark. Dishonor uh, Dishonor 2. 2, yeah. I know that game. Put it up there. Okay, so Dishonor 2 is going to be, for me, it would be um, underneath God of War 2. But it would be above uh, Galaxy. So put it where you want it. It would be under God of War 2. Or like the, the PlayStation. Sorry. Oh. So I was I was looking at Oh. I was thinking the second God of War we listed. I'd put it in between oh. there and uh Galaxy. But if you haven't played it, you can bump it to wherever I in that range. I haven't played it, so I'll put it I'll say it's definitely better than Galaxy, in my opinion. Okay, I'll just put it over Galaxy. But Dishonored One Go up. Oh. Amazing. Amazing. I'll put it at the bottom of Amazing. Rebecca watched me play a little bit of Dishonored 2. But dude, I play Dishonored 1. Yeah. And I I compare other games to Dishonored 1. Hold on. Can we just put Pong in there? The games of all time. I understand. <clears throat> it's only until after the video that we do this. <laughs> um, right, Firewatch? Yeah, I, I, I compare games to Dishonored when uh, it comes to, like, do I think it's a good game? Okay, Like yeah. the regular one. So I, I put it pretty up there. Like Firewatch, have you ever played it? No. I don't know what it is. Uh, For Honor? House of Ashes? No. Inside? No. Binding of Isaac? I played it on the Vita. I don't know which one that is. We're just going to say our experience. I think that's Afterbirth you, Plus. You played it? I n I've seen other people play it. I've played it. It's a it's a decent game. I'll put it. I would not say it's anywhere near as good as Enter the Gungeon, but that's just my experience. I'll put it above Mario 2. Okay. It, it's a decent game. That's all I'll say. It's, well. It's, it's decent. I, I'll move Street Fighter 2 down to you decent. You feeling it? Yeah. Well. I don't know. Jedi Fallen Order? No. Uh, Journey? No. Left 4 Dead 2? No. Limbo? Pretty good. Um, I'll put it in good or very good. All right. Uh, do you Bottom like it more of than very good or like middle of good? Like it more than Skyrim? Where is Skyrim? Top of good? Oh, no. I'll put it like... I liked it more than Celeste, but not as much as Mario Odyssey. I'll put it, like, underneath Mass Effect. Uh, Mass Effect 2, yeah. Okay. I'll put it under there. It's a pretty good game. It was very enjoyable to play it. What did you think about Skyrim again? It was really, like, I, I thought it was a great game. I'll move it. I'll put it in great. Bottom I, of... I really liked it. But I like Terraria more. All right, so I'll put it at the bottom of very good, because I thought it. I thought I think it's a good game. I would put Skyrim in good, so I think this is a good place for okay. it. Uh. Homebrew. I don't know what this is. Just put it out on there. Outlast. No. Getting over it. Not Bennett Foddy. Not. Bennett I've never played Foddy. it. I think. You played it. Have Have you played? It? Yeah, okay. I I played it for a little bit. A little bit enough. I put it under Pong, but over Apex. <laughs> I agree. Papers, please. 
I've never played it. Bad or really bad for me. Really? I think Paper Please is a good game. I didn't enjoy it at all. Better than Dark Souls? You know what? It's actually going to be right there with Dark Souls. It's one of those where I watched Jack play it, Jack Septica, mm-hmm. and I was like, I'm going to play Papers, Please, and it's going to be awesome. Oh. And I saved up my money, and I bought the game, and then I played it for like three yeah. hours, and I was like, I'm deleting this. It's not even on my Steam anymore. It's like deleted. It's like gone. Okay, you made me paranoid earlier when we asked if... Wait, just just because we've been recording for 20, 30 minutes, and I was like, we have yeah, to make sure 20, for 30 minutes. 20, 30, yeah. No, whenever I ask oh. that. <laughs> it's been almost an hour. This is one video. Yeah, I know. This is a good video. Uh, Resident Evil, the most recent one. Uh, the one with the no, tall woman. Never played it. Roblox. Never played it. I like it. Put it where you want, kid. I'll agree. I've seen a lot of Roblox stuff. I like it better than Skyrim, but I won't put it over Terraria for you. Okay. Uh, I'm not going to fight you on that. Rocket a lot Le- of people will fight you saying <laughs> Roblox is a better game than Elder Scrolls. Okay, okay, hear me out. But I'm fine with it. I that. don't think it's objectively a better game than Skyrim. But it's your experience. But it's funnier than Skyrim. Th- this is about your experience playing yeah. the game. So I like, I'm fine with that. I, I grew up on Roblox, right? I'm down. Okay. Rocket League. I really enjoyed it, but I only played against bots. I think it's okay. I'll say it's like... I think it's... Good. Uh, yeah, good. Um, uh, under Fortnite. Over Celeste? Yeah. For me. For me. You put it where you want relative to your emotions. I so. would put Celeste over over uh, okay. Rocket League, but I'll leave I'd be it... Fine. I'd be fine putting Rocket League like towards the bottom, too. I just... I'll leave that's it... That's where I feel. I'll put it over Mario. Do you yeah, like? Okay. Do you like it better than Mario Odyssey? Oh, I love Mario Odyssey way more. But like, here we'll I'll, just, I'll I'll do that. We'll just put it there. I'll I'll put it under Mario Odyssey. We need to make like the same tier list, but like. But just our own. What do you mean? Like we make our own individual ones. No, just like if this is actually a good game. Oh, like, like is it a, a good more game? objective one. Yeah. Okay. Because this one's fully emotional. Uh, Beat Saber? No. I've played it. It's really fun. I believe it. I've never played it. I'm not I don't think it's a bad game. I think it's a great or I'll very good game. I'll put it in very good just cuz like I've never played it. The physical aspect of it. It you works you to, out. Yeah. I'll put it at bottom of very good. Uh, Silent Hill 2? Nope. Sims 4? Oh. Decent. All right. I'll I'll put it under Sonic or above Battlefield, yeah. That's a good spot. Okay. Second Son? I don't know. It's a good game, but I've never played it. Civ. I've, I've played all the Civ games. It'll be fine. Okay. Uh, all the Civ games, I'll just put them in good. Right. Where I, I'll put any of them in good. Civ 6 is going to be very top of good. I'll just put it like around Over Galaxy Uncharted? 2. I'll put it in Galaxy 2. Where's Galaxy 2? Bottom right. Over Galaxy 2? Yeah. Spider-Man PS4? I've... <sighs> All right, what's your opinion? Amazing or great? Okay, I'll agree. I, I want to say amazing. Not because he's the amazing <laughs> Spider-Man, but like, it's just, this, this is the new one that came out, right? Yeah, for PS4. Yeah, where you got to just like fly and swing. Uh-huh. I've only played it for a little bit, but I watched my brother play through basically Dude, the whole game. I loved the game. It's, it, the story is really well written too. And it just graphically looks there, really nice. There's another game where I can't remember the name of it, but it's like Infernal or Inferno. And it it reminds me of this Spider-Man game, and I love Inferno so much. I can't remember the name of it. So, bottom of Amazing? I'll put it in Amazing. It's under Dishonored, though. Okay. Spore? I like it. I think I've played it. Which game is Spore? The one where you like make your little monster and you evolve it and you survive and stuff. I think I played it for like an hour. I don't have an opinion. Yeah. It, it would be a decent game for me. Yeah, but... I'll put it top of decent. Okay. I'll put it over Isaac. Okay. That's what I was going to say. Wii Sports. How do you rank Wii Sports? Hard overrated. I think it's definitely fun, but it's not like the best game in the world. It's not better than Beat Saber. Yeah. And I wouldn't put it above Fortnite or Odyssey. Yeah. I'll put it by Rocket League. I'll I'd put it over. 
Sword and Shield. Would I put it? I'd, I'd put it over Pac-Man, but not over Sword and okay. Shield. That's good. Okay. I like that Sword and Shield is like in a completely different spot than how we feel about something two places above it. <laughs> well, like Sword and Shield, it's like uh, Mario Odyssey. No, it's not even close to this. But it's like <laughs> three games separating it. Bully? No. Deus Ex? No. Machina? Whatever that is. Why does it look familiar? It That's looks like Loki. Matrix Revelations. Oh, not Matrix. I've never played that game. We're Factorio? No. Fallout 4? Really good game. But it's not as it's not as good as Red Dead. It's going to be in very good for me. Okay. Better, it's going to be like... Better than Borderlands? Above Borderlands. That's where I'd put it. Okay. The second one specifically, in case anyone wants to know. Borderlands 2, I really enjoyed. Uh, what is that... I think that's another Fallout I mean, game. I would just put all the Fallouts down there. I played seven, like, at the bottom, like, for I don't know. Oh. Because I don't know the Fallout game. 76? I played 76 for five minutes on my Switch. I'll say I don't know. It's not on Switch. Far Cry 5? Yeah, it is. 76? My dad downloaded it because it was free. No, that's, that's not 76. That's the, like... Uh, Shelter? Yeah. Okay. I think I played on PC then. Anyway, it doesn't matter. I played it for five minutes, and <laughs> right. it's in the I don't know part anyway. I'll say no. We gotta be almost done, right? Far Cry, another one? Uh, no. Warcraft, whatever no. it is. Counter Newgrounds? Strike? No. Gary's Mod? No. Guitar Hero 3? Yes, I'll put it in good. Okay. Or decent. Uh, better than Spore? I don't know, I haven't played Spore. Uh, we'll put it right there in between. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, okay. Uh, Heyday? No. Hitman? No. Hotline Miami? No. I don't know what that is. I think, is that Uncharted? Or Left 4 Dead? Just Cause 2. No. Kingdom it it looks kind of like Nathan Drake. Kingdom Hearts, I th- want to say that's 3. Wait, they're not... For s- 2? That's not 365... That's so hard to tell. Which one do you want to call it? Two or three? Hold on. Does it actually matter to you? Which one it is? Kingdom Hearts. Wait, it can't be Kingdom Hearts 3. Because didn't 3 just come out, or was that 4? Kingdom Hearts box art. <laughs> that's, that's Kingdom Hearts 3. Which? I haven't played any of them. Didn't, <laughs> didn't 4 just come out? No, 3 just came out. Three is the one that just came out. That's the most recent one. And well, it's the one where they play the with most, Toy Story. And yeah, the, technically the most recent one is that rhythm game. And, but, and it had like Tangled in it and stuff. Yeah. I'll put it wherever you want. <sighs> Scroll up, I want to look at him. I've heard mixed opinions. Some people think it's masterpiece. Some people think it's horrible. I'll... Put it above Rocket League or Mario Odyssey. And good. I really liked it, but not as much as 365 and a half. Do you like it better than Odyssey? My experience, yeah. Okay. My experience playing both, but I had different Have you played any Life is Strange? No. Metro? We're never going to get through this tier list. We're almost done. Uh, I don't know what that is. It's probably Batman. I'll just say no. No. I think that's near Automata. If we don't know what it is, then... <laughs> I don't know what that is. No. Path of Exile? No. Uh, Plants vs. Zombies? Yes. Really liked it. I really like that game. I'll say great. Okay. Because my personal experience, I really like the game. I was going to say very good, so I'll put it at the bottom. Of... Yeah. I don't like it more than Breath of the Wild. Okay. We could put it above League. That's funny. Can I, can I do this? Yeah. Zelda, bottom of great. Lee can hold the L. <laughs> Postal? No. Prototype? No. Rainbow Six Siege? <sighs> Go ahead, <laughs> put it up there. <laughs> My experience playing it is... We haven't had a masterpiece or a horrible yet. My ex- it's not. I know. I'm, I'm not. My experience is gonna be a oh, shoot. It'll be after Uncharted. 
somewhere after Uncharted. Better than Bioshock? Yeah. Okay, I'll put it... I mean, my experience playing Mario was better than Bioshock. I'll put it right here. I think we can move Bioshock down. Moves Bioshock to Modern Warfare 3, like above it, like after Rocket League. Yeah. Okay. I'll move that there. Uh, Saints Row 2? <clears throat> no. It's a good game. Sniper Elite 3? No. I don't know what that is. Stalker? No. Original Battlefront 2? I'm skipping it. I haven't played it, but I know it's a great game. I'm skipping it. Ba New Battlefront 2? Skipping it. Super Hot? I'll put it... Oh, that's a good game. Where would you put it? I was going to put Around it... Around Pac-Man. Over Beat Saber. Really? Did you play it? Yeah. Okay. I didn't finish it, but I enjoyed what I played a lot. I've played it all. I'd say it's around good. Or I'll, I'll put it. I'll I'll give you Beat Saber. I'll put it over Pokemon. I'd be fine if you wanted to put it. You, you said you were gonna put it around here. I'll yeah, put it before Pac Man. I'll put it over Lego Star Wars. Okay. Uh, I don't know what that is. No. Undertale. No. I really like Undertale. Fine, we can put it somewhere. <laughs> I wouldn't say this it's a masterpiece. Can't be the masterpiece. I wouldn't can say it? it's a master. No, no, no. I, I wasn't gonna try and it's, say it's Undertale. It's not is as a good as Spider Man. No, definitely not. I wouldn't. I but don't like it more than Breath of the Wild. But you like it more than PVZ. I like Undertale more than Fire Emblem. Ah, oh, snap. <laughs> Where would you put it? Have you played it? I've played it. Mo I've done all the endings. I've done every ending but genocide. Than all of them. Where would you put it? Honest answer. My experience and emotions playing the game. Yeah. Just drop it. Let go. You sure? Just let it go. Are you sure? I don't want to talk Dylan, about it. Dylan, talk about it. This is what this is what we're here for. I I don't want to give the people a dishonest I, representation. I put it in um, great for my time when I did play it. Would you actually? Not anymore, but back then when I yeah, played Yeah, when you it, first played it. When I like, first had the most enjoyment, I would like, say Greater Amazing. Because we're not letting the community, like... No, no, no. Like, I played it. It's one of those things I played it, and it was the best game I've ever played in my life, and it was inspiring and awesome. Mm -hmm. And then, like, three months went by, and I went, it's an R.A. game. Okay, so would you... I'd put it in very good. I'd just leave, leave it there. Do you like it better than Fire Emblem? No. All right, I'll drop it under Fire but Emblem. But it's, it's under Dishonored. But I'd be fine leaving it there. Okay, because I wanted to put it over Fire Emblem. I think, yeah, it, it is what it is. Okay. Who cares? Pokemon Red and Blue? I don't like these games at all. Would I be biased to say I've played them if I say I've played Leaf Green? No. And, and I've played Yellow? Yellow, I would say, yeah. I've played Yellow. I'll include Yellow in this. Um, I actually, for Pokemon Home, I wanted to go through every single generation. Mm -hmm. And I wanted to put them in my Pokemon Home. Like, I wanted to play Pokemon Gen 1 and then get all the Pokemon in that gen and complete the Pokedex. And I did that for Pokemon Yellow and, like, a couple ones going up. I don't like the Pokemon Game Boy games. I actually I can't talk. Pokemon I can't say Yellow, anything for Gen 2, but just, like... I thought like, Pokemon Yellow was good. I was going to put them in, like... I'll put it in decent. I'll put it in decent. Okay. Uh, so where are you going to put it? It does depend, because I'll put it underneath XCOM. I think it's a better game than Ocarina. It's definitely better than Papers, Please. You gotta give it to them. It's the game that made Pokemon big. Yeah, okay. And it's got it's better than Papers, Please. I just don't think they've aged well at all. I would put it by Papers, Please, unless you just have a different opinion. You would put it by Papers, Please? Above it. Above. Yeah, I, I was thinking right here. Because I like... Fine. I think both of these are bad games, but I like Zelda uh, Ocarina of Time more than Pokemon... Red and blue specifically. Yeah. <coughs> Motorcycle funny. Is that? It's New Horizons. New Horizons. Uh, you didn't like it. Oh. I had a great time playing it. I, in the moment, it was very good. That's what I'm, t we're talking about in the moment yeah, when we like, play these games and enjoy them. Because if we're talking about months later after, Undertale's going down to good. Okay, but months later after is At, like, the point of Animal Crossing. Them. Right. What do you mean? Because Animal Crossing is a long-term experience. Undertale is a one and done. Animal Crossing, you're supposed to keep playing it for those months. I, I just meant months when you're done playing it. But that's the point of Animal Crossing. You're not supposed to be done playing it. 
and it doesn't do a good job of keeping your attention. Unlike previous Animal Crossings. But that's like, that's fully opinionated. Because there are people that still play Animal Crossing to this day since launch. Okay. Compared to New Leaf, I, I, I call it the Animal Crossing cycle. I would actually put New Leaf in Horrible. I could. I thought New Leaf. I'd put the, New Leaf the in like only, great. The only Animal Crossing worse than New Leaf is the one on the Wii with the Circle World. I That's will settle opinion. and put New I'll, Horizons I'll in, good. in good. I'll put it in good. Maybe bottom. I'll put it... I had a really great time because I played it with someone who also had a great time and we talked about it a lot for months. And if you are playing one game consistently for like two or three months, maybe even longer than that, I'll that put has it to be a good game, right? Over Wii Sports. But how long did you play it for? I played it for a pretty decent amount of time. Months? Yeah. But how long have you played, have you sat down and played Crash or like any of the other games down there that you've played? I'm going to bump Crash on your Doom. <laughs> but like compar- <laughs> comparatively to the other games, how long have you played some of these other games? Like it did get your attention for certain, like Mario Odyssey. Well, like, you played it way more than Mario Odyssey. You played Mario Odyssey the for length, one weekend. The length of the game. You know, if we were ranking these by, like, I don't want to rank it by, like, I don't want to say long Did you time better. travel? No. Not that it would have invalidated anything. It's just curious because you were talking about the length of it. No, I don't time travel in Animal Crossing games. I'd be fine leaving it somewhere in good. Uh, let's just leave it right here for now, and if we want to change it later, we I, can. I'm good with that. Just for the sake of getting on with this. Black 2. <laughs> <sighs> I think you know my opinion. What's your opinion? I don't think I know it. I um, I, I'm pretty sure I like Black and White more than Black Two and White Two. I agree, but that doesn't make them bad games. No, I very w- good. I would say very good at very least. Very good. More under than League, Roblox. Under Portal. Under Portal. I'll put it over Super Metroid. My opinion's Under Portal. If you want to put it somewhere else, that's fine. I think this is good. Okay. I, I would love Black and White. I'd put like it Pokemon. over... I'd put it between... If this were my list, I would have it between Galaxy and Undertale. But I think this is a good spot for it. Okay. Cuphead? No. We haven't uploaded the video yet. <laughs> <laughs> can this be, like... Can this be the intro to the first Cuphead video? <laughs> <laughs> I'm... Okay, but for real, for real... I are you gonna put it in very good because you know the background of the animation and you know how long it took and you know the beauty of it? Or are you gonna put it there because you actually played it and this was your boss fight experience? When you play it, you get mad. Yeah, but I you still, rage quit. I still like it a lot. Yes, I would put it in very good. I'd put it at least very good. I put it in very good. I I'd put it around. I like I'd it put better it under than... black and white. I was gonna put it top of very good. So, so we can communicate. You know what? I'll I'll give you that. You can put it around league. I'll put it. I'll oh, concede. I'll put it over league, but under PVZ. Do you like PVZ more than Cuphead? Yeah, based on my experience okay. and my emotions and my funness. Yes. Death Stranding. No. Diablo, I think two. We'll we'll skip it. We'll skip it. I don't want to talk about Diablo. Specifically two. No. I don't think... What the heck is that? I'm going to have to look up which one I played. <laughs> what is that? Kid Bop. <laughs> Grounded? I think I've played Diablo 3. Okay. Grounded? I don't know what that is. Just Dance 2020. <laughs> yeah, I've played Diablo 3. So NBA 2K20. Actually, I've played, I think, this one. I'm Persona 5 no, Royal. Because I don't know. I never played the Royals. Uh, Sly Cooper 3. No. Nah. Spec Ops? No. Valorant? <laughs> Put it above Apex. <laughs> Where is Apex? Under oh, getting over it. Okay. <laughs> Dang it! I can move getting over it. No, it's just funny because I was like, yeah, it's right above Apex. And I went, no. Crusader Kings no. 2. Divinity. No. Where's Devil Survivor? I don't know what this is. No. 
I've never played Portrait Dragon of Quest Ginger. Dragon Quest Eleven. That's yeah. a good game. I haven't played it. It's a very enjoy. Uh, oh. I'll put it over Dragon Ball. Okay. Dying Light. No. Fall Guys. No. <laughs> I've never played it. I'm gonna put it. I like it better than Spore. <laughs> Fall Guys is just now hitting its second peak, if anyone's curious about it. Uh, Half-Life Alex. No. Last of Us 2? Mm-mm. Metal Gear 1? Mm-mm. Oblivion? I didn't like it. I'll put it in bad or decent. I think it's a decent game, but my experience was bad. I'll put it above... All of, it'd be top, top. Top of bad. Top of bad? Okay. I did not like it very much. Payday 2? No. Persona 3? I think that's the one with Teddy in it. No, that's no, Persona 4. that's Golden. This is the one where they shoot themselves. I thought he was also in that one. Teddy? Are we coming the same dude? The little red dude with the black eyes and the... I think I think Teddy's... Teddy's the bear. Yeah. He, he's in 4. I want to look at the cast, because I remember these games by the cast, not by the name. Persona's the blue. Three's the blue one. I'll put it in, uh... I'll just say not played. I don't have a lot of this game, but I, I have more in four. Alright, four golden. I'm gonna look at the people again to remember them. Yeah, that's Teddy. That's my boy. From what I've played... I'll say good. From what I played of four golden, which is like about an hour of it, I liked it, but it's not really enough to give an opinion on a Persona game. I'll say good. Good, uh... Better than you super. You liked it. Better than super hot. Yeah. Better than Modern Warfare Three. Yeah, I'll leave it under Bioshock for now. Okay. Okay. Rust. Mm -mm. Uh, Saints Row, mm -mm. whatever. Titanfall Two. I'll go to Warzone. Warzone's uh decent. I'll put it, like, under XCOM. Or I'll put it next to Call of Duty Modern Warfare. But I feel like Call of Duty Modern Warfare should be under Apex. Really? Well, actually... No, take my opinion out of it. Just put it under XCOM. Okay. Uh, I don't know what that is. Shovel Knight! I love Shovel Knight. Very good game. I love Shovel Knight. Close to a masterpiece, actually. Yeah, I was... I want to put Shovel Knight in, like... I wouldn't hate putting in a masterpiece. For some reason, I just don't have any negative feelings towards it. I think... My only negative feeling towards Shovel Knight Are we Shovel Knight, Shovel Knight is, as Shovel of Hope or Shovel Knight Treasure Trove as a whole? I meant the entire thing. Like, All of it. Okay, if we're just saying Shovel of Hope, I'd say Masterpiece. But I didn't really like King of Cards that much. Well, it's... it's and I think Showdown is not good. Excuse me, I'm competitive in Showdown. Anyway, what showdown is that? The card game? No, that's the uh, that's the platform fighter, but it doesn't have platform fighting mechanics. It has shovel knight mechanics. There was a fighter. Yeah. It feels bad to play. Was the fighter in Treasure Trove? Mm-hmm. The only thing I know about Shovel Knight is the the different campaigns. Like Shovel of Hope, Plague of Shadows, and Specter of Torment. That's what all, I'm. That's what I'm talking about. Those are about. excellent games. That's all I'm talking about. The but I think that's my only experience with Shovel Knight. I would bump it down to Amazing because of uh, King of Cards <clears throat> and uh, and uh, Showdown holding it back. Specifically Showdown. Like if Shovel Knight, I, I would put it in Masterpiece because I've only played the campaigns. You know what? I'll I'll leave it in Masterpiece. And I kind of feel like Just... Mario needs to go at the bottom of Amazing. Smash? Yeah. But that's just me. Because I like all of those games. Well, I would put Dishonored above Mario. And I would put Portal. You know what? That's fine. Because you like it and you haven't played Dishonored. That's fine. That's fine. Okay. That's fine. Uh, I don't know what that is. Dragon Ball Kakarot. No. Uh, Dead by Daylight. All right, we're going to put this in. <laughs> <laughs> I'll put it wherever you want. Anywhere. I, I don't care. <laughs> I know what you're thinking. 
white guys. <laughs> it goes in the white guy tier. Oh, this game. <laughs> Which meme do I go with? Un- <laughs> under NBA 2K20? Yes. <laughs> Put it there. Put it at the bottom. Hi, Sebastian. Put it at the bottom. DuckTales Remastered? I don't know. I played for, for like a little bit, and it looks fun. But I like Untitled Goose Game. No. Have you ever played it? I think it's very short and sweet. I've seen it. I think it's a good game. I wouldn't put it in like very good. I'd put it in for, decent or good from my knowledge of watching from, the For game. what it is. But I haven't played it. I'll put it. I want to put it over Animal Crossing. Okay. I'll, I'm perfectly fine with that. But you're also putting it over Wii Sports. I like it better than Wii Sports. Okay, that's fine. I'll put it right here. Uh, Hollow Knight? You know my opinion. Just masterpiece material. I wouldn't put it in masterpiece. I think think if they added the bone lava area to Hollow Knight, it would have been masterpiece. But they didn't add that because they said the game was too big already. I don't like it better than Breath of the Wild. Okay, that's fine. So I'll settle for... I'll settle for that. Okay. We'll both... It, we're both like, yeah, we'll settle. Yeah. <laughs> I don't like it better than Breath of the Wild. I would put it in, like, top of good or, like, middle of very good. Okay. I'd put it under... Batman? Which one? Uh, that one. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I'll just say I don't know. Okay. Flight Simulator? No. Golf it. No More Heroes 2? Mm-mm. Uh, something Shogun 2? No. Subnautica? No. Super Seducer? Mm-mm. Warhammer? No. Yakuza? No More Heroes 1? Mm-mm. Ghost of Tsushima? No. Ori? Yes. That's Ori Will of the Wisp specifically. Wait. It's the sequel. <sighs> Not Ori in the Blind Forest? I think that says Will of the Wisps. I've played Blind Forest. I don't know if they're the same thing or not. There's Will of the Wisps is a sequel. No. Okay. Uh, Bayonetta? No. Cold War? Oh, I didn't like that game. That's Call of Duty, right? Yeah. Yeah, I'll put it in bad. But it's a really... It's it's not a bad game, but I didn't like it. I'll put it under Dark Souls. Uh, Crusader Kings 3? No. Cyberpunk? No. Uh, Doom Eternal? No. Final Fantasy VII Remake? Hey, you you fix that tier list right now. <laughs> Final Fantasy You fix that tier list Final, right now. Final. <laughs> oh, my bad. No. <laughs> Final Fantasy VII Remake? No. It's it's beautiful and gorgeous. I just haven't played it. Hades? No. I've played it. It's a good game. Yeah. I just haven't played it. I'll put it in... I can look at a game and be like, that looks like a really fun game, but I haven't played it, so I just say no. I'll put it over super hot. Okay. That's valid. Uh, I think this is Hearthstone. It's Hearthstone. Have you played it? Too much. <laughs> Not an addicting amount, but enough to put it in... I'm just looking at Fall Guys. Um, <laughs> it's not even close to League, but it has an association with League and Rainbow. Would oh. you put Rainbow in, t- like, top of good? Rainbow's top of good. Uh. I'll, I'll associate it with uh, low good. Okay, better than Mario low, Galaxy yeah, 2. Yeah, put it under there. Okay. Better than Lego Indiana Jones, but not as good as Mario you Galaxy did that, man. 2. I'll say, I'll, can, I'll say it's under Lego Indiana Jones, but I thought Lego should be... I've played Lego. Yeah. And I said it was very good. Or, like, good. I'll put I'll put Indiana Jones back in good. I think you just, like, changed it when I wasn't looking. <laughs> I bumped it down to decent just because I... It's okay. You had a sober up moment where you go, it's decent, but I said it was good. <laughs> Hitman 2, I think? Mm-mm. That's body Super guard. Liminal? No. Uh, Avengers? No. Wasteland? No. Yakuza? <laughs> we did it! Here's our tier list, guys. This is the actual... The only masterpiece was Shovel Knight. (laughs) Dead by Daylight. (laughs) So the best game is Shovel Knight, and the worst game is Dead by Daylight. If you play Shovel Knight, we love you. If you play Dead by Daylight, we hate you. I hate myself, so it works out. (laughs) You know, this is very interesting to 
look at a tier list from this perspective. Do you want to reorganize anything? I want to reorganize everything. <laughs> right. Because I I think some of these games, like, Are... in comparison to each... I, put, I tried to put each of these games individually without comparison to the other ones. But on the list, mm -hmm. in order, I compared it to the other ones. But, like, which tier I felt like it was, I didn't compare it. <clears throat> right. Like, I looked at Hollow Knight and I went... To me, it's amazing. It's gorgeous. It's like top. Right. But but we put it in great just because I don't feel as strongly as you do. Yeah, and I think this is an interesting tier list because we have like yeah, totally different opinions about games and it's what a we lot, enjoy. It's a lot more interesting than if we just would have made the tier list by ourselves. Yeah. I'm going to – I'm gonna now I'm going to go make a tier list and upload <laughs> it. And it's going to be fully biased, my tier list and my experience. Where are we going to put this? I don't know. I just wanted to save the image. <clears throat> All right. Well, any closing thoughts? I feel like we can both agree that Shovel Knight is not the best game on this list. But I think that's what makes it funny that it's the best game on this list. <laughs> we can, it's the only game that we both agree. Yeah, this is like Masterpiece or close to Masterpiece material. Right. But This is the game that we, we need to play Shovel Knight then because it's co-op. Come back to the next episode of White Guys where we play Shuffle Night. Yo. <laughs> Yo.